Greetings and a very blessed Christmas to you. May you have a wonderful Christmas day today in how, whatever way, whatever, uh, how you're going to be celebrating this special day, maybe uh, worshiping God in, in a church service or maybe with your family and friends or what, how are you going to celebrate it? Of course, it's all about Jesus and it's all because of Jesus. So I want to encourage you to take a moment to look to Jesus and say, thank you for coming into this world. Thank you for all that you are to me. Thank you for being my Lord, for being my Savior, for being my good and great shepherd, for being the mighty God in my life, for being my wonderful Savior, my blessed Redeemer. And today, I want to remind you that Jesus is the conquering king. You know, as we look at the manger, and of course, every Christmas, we think about the fact that God would so humble himself to be born in, 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 as, as a little baby, as a little child. Let us never forget that today he is the conquering king. We thank God for that meek and lowly manner in which he came. He did his work on the earth. He died for us on the cross. He was raised up the third day. He showed himself alive to his disciples and he ascended into heaven and he's seated at the right hand of the Father. Having conquered Satan, having conquered death, having conquered all of hell. And he is exalted, crowned with glory and honor far above the heavens, above all angels, glorified as he was before the foundations of the world. And he is the conquering king. And the apostle Paul, as he writes in 1 Timothy, he reminds us who Jesus Christ is. He tells us in 1 Timothy chapter 6, verses 15 and 16, that he, that is Jesus, is the blessed and only potentate, the King of kings and Lord of lords, who alone has immortality dwelling in unapproachable light, whom no man has seen nor can see, to whom be honor and everlasting power. Amen. This Christmas day, remember, Jesus is the blessed and only potentate. There is only one king in all the universe. There is only one Lord. There is only one who is king of kings and lord of lords. There is only one potentate, and it's our blessed Jesus, the conquering king, who has conquered all of hell, who has conquered all of Satan, all his demons, who has conquered every sin, he has conquered all of death. And he lives eternally, our blessed Lord, the conquering King. We worship him because he is worthy. He's exalted. He's glorified. There's no one else like him. And we bow before him. Oh, come, let us adore him. Oh, come, let us adore him. Christ, the Lord, the potentate, the King. Let's worship Him. Lord Jesus, today we worship You. We recognize You came in a humble manner, but we also recognize today You are the blessed and only potentate in all realms, the King of all kings, the Lord of all lords. You alone are worthy. You alone deserve our praise. And we bow before you and worship you, our conquering King. Be glorified. We love you. We want to serve you. We want to honor you in our lives. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.